Hello and welcome to a request. This is going to be a little bit of a different video uh, than I normally do. This is more of a power leveling video. Uh, the title will probably say that. So uh, what I have here is I have a group of level twos ish. I don't even know. Uh, I think they're all level two. Uh, yeah, they're all level two. And they're level two because the bard needed to be level two to get chords of dissonance. Uh, as you can see, I am currently using a Honed Worm Slayer and a Skull of Null. Skull of Null will negate all magic damage to me, uh, to me up to 750 points. And the uh, Worm Slayer does the same thing for physical damage. And we are in, uh, what is this stone here? This is <laughs> a level one rabbit right there. Uh, this is Icefall Glacier. So what I have with me. Uh, besides uh, these characters, they're all just level twos that I made. Uh, I have a 120 cleric and a 120 druid for kind of safety reasons. <laughs> if I die, I can res them back and stuff like that. Uh, but what the gist of this is, is I should be able to just go up to these. Uh, this is a level 71 mob. I should be able to go up to it and uh, kill it. As you can see, we already lost. We already lost everybody right there. Uh, let me uh, try to trap. I don't know if I have my hockeys. I just moved this character over from. Uh... All right, I've uh, I've recovered from the instant death of the wolf. All right, so what we got going here? So I'm gonna try to get this going. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cast uh, blood of. Do I still have memorized blood of the adherent onto the wolf? which puts a reverse damage shield onto it. And uh, let's go over here to combat. You can see now we're doing lots more damage, uh, but we're not taking any damage, right? So that's the gist of this. So you can see right here, just slowly beating this thing down like so. And if I could actually get uh, the song to play, I can make sure that I'm actually doing damage to it. But I did not uh, like level up any uh, anything. <laughs> Beforehand, so this is a little a little slow here, and I got all the, I don't have all the macros set up on these guys at the moment. But uh, yeah, there we go. That's kicking down. If I target, can I target her? Oh, and druids get a damage shield that does an insane amount of damage. Uh, where'd it go? I don't, for some reason, don't have it on my, uh, I don't have it on my bar for some reason. Wrath of the Wild, is that it? Yeah, there it is. Gives 120 point damage shield. I should be able to just cast that on her, like so, and kill that. Now... They didn't, she didn't do any damage to it. So we're gonna, what we're going to do, we need to set this up a little better. So let me uh, get this set up so I can show this off a little bit better. This is, I'm uh, in a bad spot and I got killed. <laughs> All right, so we have our adolescent wolf right here. I'm uh, meleeing it now. I'm trying to get song going. I need to tag this thing uh, with uh, any kind of damage. Uh, since I have the Worm Slayer in my hand, I cannot uh, do any damage, and this is going to resist everything. So what I might have to do, I have a weapon. Uh, where did I put it? Right here. So I might have to tag him. I might not be able to hit him at all. So it's just going to take a few minutes to get him tagged here. And that, that is the reverse damage shield from the druid. I mean, the, uh, the cleric, uh, which can, if you have enough mobs, it will spread other ones. Uh, we're just going to do one for right now. Until, uh, until we can actually do damage to it. 
Uh, it's, at 17, I'll get dual wield, then I can put the weapon on the offhand. But, uh, there we go. It died from... Oh, I still have those massive thorns on. All right. Let me try this again. I uh, just kind of get this set up, and then once I do it, it should make a little bit more sense. I don't know what happened, but uh, this rabbit somehow ran into me and got killed, and I leveled up to level uh, level three. Kind of funny, but uh, I'm trying to get another one. I am not have not been successful. I had that high level uh, damage shield still on, so it kind of like wiped out the mob like instantaneously. And then we're just going to cast the blood again. You know, this is a little bit more difficult. Uh, and it, it's getting patched next Wednesday anyway. Uh, or it'll be patched after I release this video. I haven't decided yet. But uh, the Honed Worm Soul Air does, re does no, no longer give the benefit uh, at uh, levels. So it's kind of one of those uh, things. That I'm just kind of showing as a uh, matter of fact, but uh, it's more difficult <laughs> than I expected to actually tag these things. Uh, so I'm going to keep trying until I can get in, get this thing tagged. All right, that seemed to not work as well as I was told it would, or I'm doing something wrong. So I got, I got killed one eventually, uh, like my warrior, I had him hitting the mob. I uh, had the Berserker hitting the mob, and I had the Bard hitting the mob. Eventually, one of them tagged it, uh, instantly got killed, and then uh, when that mob died, we got up to level 4. So what I'm going to do is I'm falling back to uh, Blightfire Moors for right now. Uh, so we are level 4, and what we're going to do is we'll figure out why the this guy stopped following us. Uh, we're going to grab everybody, Oh, we're going to go over here to these cats, and uh, sing the AoE song in the middle, and hopefully that is uh, going to get us going. All right, we're over here at the cat area now, so what I'm going to do is just uh, go in here, and hopefully my songs can actually land on these. This one's resisting. So we might have to go find lower level mobs, even, even lower. Ah, uh, this one's a named one, so let's see what happens if I tag it with that. There we go. Uh, you can see here the Worm Slayer is perfectly awesome, right? <laughs> we didn't get, uh, I don't think we got experience for that one. Maybe we did, I don't know. Yeah, we got experience for that, so we got uh, almost nothing. It's not a lot of experience. See if I can get uh, this going. There we go. And they're going to resist. So if I cast uh, blood on these ones. Now this should spread to the, all of them, right? The way that spell works is it does have a chance to spread. So uh, it did. And it looks like we're getting, we are getting the experience. There we go. We got uh, level five now. So I think what the problem was is I was just going to too high of level mobs. Which, uh, this is going to be fine. Tag this one. And uh, yeah, it's just it, this this thing's getting nerfed soon. I wanted to make a little video on it to kind of show it. But uh, yeah, it prevents all damage. And uh, this is kind of a Feronavi only kind of thing, I guess since it's, it's tradable on Feronavi, right? It's not tradable on normal servers, and it's harder to get... You have to like, actually put some effort into it to get it for uh, a level... You know, a level one or so character otherwise. But uh, at this point, I wouldn't even bother trying to get it for such a low-level character because it's not really... Uh, it, I mean, normal damage shield power leveling is uh, far superior to this, I would say. Especially the amount of stuns that the uh, bard's going to get. So if we just kind of go like this. If I stand right here and I try to get... I'm not sure who they're attacking.
Oh, they're attacking the cleric. So the, uh, the cleric... I think they're attacking the cleric. Uh, the cleric is healing somebody. There we go. Let's get blood on there and try to get this going. As you can see, I'm uh, completely chained on There we go, level 6. And... There we go, tagged none of those. I don't even know who's uh, getting hit here. Uh, the cleric. So, there we go. And what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to level up a little bit more, and then we'll go back to Icefall Glacier and try that out again. Uh, but right now, I don't feel like this is uh, this is much better than what I could do if I just had the druid and I did normal stuff, right? Because <laughs> that's pretty much where I'm at right now. I could give uh, I would uh, probably switch to the uh, the warrior. I have a warrior in the group, and have him be the uh, kind of primary uh, one. And it looks like I am landing some of the spells on these things. Just. I can't know how much I can do about a runner. Uh, except snare it. So I'm going to level a little bit more and see where we end up after a few minutes. Alright, so I think I finally got one uh, tagged here. And uh, <laughs> this has been an interesting experience. I've gone over a few zones. I'll kind of like show the snaps where I got where I leveled up. But I'm at level 20 now. Uh, you have to take these off. Uh, and put them back on to get this uh, buff to show back up up here. <laughs> Otherwise you die. And I didn't realize that. And I think I was in uh, uh, the Mesa. And in there, uh, there are some mobs that were, I thought they were hitting too much to go through that 1700 point damage uh, uh, protection. So that was kind of weird. But uh, once I figured that out, came back here to try this out again. See how well we go here. There we go. And what do we level up to? Oh, level 20. What? That doesn't feel right. Alright, everybody else got 21. So I, I did. I'm at the end. Alright, so I'm going to keep pulling here for a little bit longer. Uh, now I'm going to kind of like cut cut at the dings kind of thing and we'll see how well this works now that I'm a little bit higher level and I can actually hit them and I have dual wield all right I'm gonna pop in for this one here so I think this is kind of why they nerfed it uh what I did is I got on my druid and I pulled uh is that six wolves at once and I just uh I'm taking no damage at all and uh now I can just kind of like watch the watch them pretty much uh, go down the cleric's uh, reverse damage shield uh, spreads to all of them. So I cast it once, spread all of them, and I just kind of just stand here tagging them as I need to. Not sure why that rabbit uh, decided to attack, but uh, that rabbit decided to attack. And uh, so here we go. It's about, they're all about to die soon. Uh, they're just taking uh, damage shield from the, uh, the druid. Oops. There we go, one down, we're 23. Let's see what these other ones down, and 24. And this should get us 25. There we go, 25. So interestingly enough, I think I was just coming here uh, a little too early. <laughs> so I came here at level two. And I couldn't land anything, but coming back about level 20 to fix that. So I'm going to keep pulling for just a little bit longer. See if I want to, I want to try to get these guys to level 70 uh, or at least level 60. Uh, I'm going to use them all for videos and uh, doing their epic weapons. But uh, let me keep doing this for just a little bit longer. All right. So uh, we are currently 47 and uh, I think I'm going to be done with this. This is, I don't know. I, uh, it, I can see the benefit of the Worm Slayer and why it was uh, such a thing, but at the same time, I prefer to just level characters and uh, 
you know, if I'm going to power level them, I'm going to do it the traditional way uh, without this kind of thing. But, you know, this thing did is now nerfed. Uh, so I'm doing this like a week before the next patch that will nerf it. So uh, I'll post the video after the fact. Uh, it's going to take me a little while to edit out some of this stuff. But uh, for the most part, you know, it is what it is. I prefer just normal leveling. But uh, we did uh, get... Uh, what is this? Uh, six characters to level 50. The bard is a throwaway character, obviously, because I don't need another bard. Uh, but uh, I am uh, now I have a berserker, <laughs> a warrior, and a cleric, a wizard, and another enchanter. So there we go. Definitely an interesting, uh, interesting thing. Kind of cool. Uh, the weapon is really cool, and I'm gonna probably use it on my Shadow Knight. He's almost too level to actually use it, so we'll probably do that, or I'll send it back uh, to the guy who uh, sent it to me. But uh, thank you very much for watching, and have a fantastic day.